first of all, we saw that animals need shelter. Shelter, of course, is a place where animal, an animal can be safe. This looks like a shelter, it looks like a tree, right? But inside the tree is a narrow space where an animal can use it as its home. Maybe a wolf or a fox can live in there. I don't know about a bear, a bear is really big, so maybe this is a little small for a bear. But this could be a good shelter for an animal to live in. Animals need shelter because it rains, it gets cold, they need some type of home. So a shelter is like a home. And we all need a home, don't we? We all need some place to be safe, where an animal can be safe. Okay, let's take a look at another thing. Another thing is a nest. A nest is kind of like a shelter too. A nest is a place where birds live. So a nest, as you can see in the tree here, birds make their homes high up in trees and it's a bird's shelter. So a bird will use this, a nest, this is also a bird's shelter. It is basically their home. It protects them, it keeps them safe from animals walking around on the ground, right? So mama bird can take care of her baby birds safely in a nest, and that's their shelter. Let's move on to the next one. Okay, another thing that all animals need to grow is oxygen. We need to breathe, right? And we breathe oxygen. Oxygen is a gas that is necessary for people and animals to live. We need oxygen to breathe. Oxygen has no color. We can't see it. It's all around us. In the room here, in the room where you are, there's oxygen in the air. You can't see it. You can feel it. If you go like this really quickly, you can feel the air. And in the air is oxygen that we need to breathe. Our bodies need oxygen. If we're diving, for example, underwater, how do we get oxygen? Well, we need to breathe through the equipment. We need to breathe. <sighs> right? If we breathe, that means to take in oxygen. So even if we're underwater and we're scuba diving, right, we have equipment that gives us oxygen so we can breathe underwater. We're not fish, right? We don't have gills, but we can use equipment to go underwater and swim around. Looks like fun. If you have a chance, try that out. Try it out scuba diving. Okay. Next, we have another verb, to hatch. Now, some animals hatch. To hatch means to come out of the egg, like this crocodile or alligator here is coming outside of the egg. It's hatching. Not all animals hatch. Hatch means to come out of an egg. Did you come out of an egg? No, you didn't come out of an egg. Uh, mammals are born without eggs. We're born live. We don't have eggs when we come out of our mother's bodies, right? we don't have eggs. But some animals like reptiles, birds, and some fish, uh, they will come out of eggs. They need to hatch. Okay, so to hatch. Another verb is to store. Animals, some animals, will store things. What will they store? Store means to keep something for future use. You've probably seen in the movies the squirrel, right? The squirrel running around, and the squirrel is running after nuts, right? N-U-T-S. So squirrels will store nuts, and squirrels are kind of, you know, the little animals, the little furry animals with the big tail. They will go and they will take nuts, and they won't eat them right away. They'll put them in their shelter, in their home. They will store them for when it's cold, and when the winter there's no food. So they store, they keep something for future use. They keep it for later. Okay, so that's to store. Another verb is to protect. Some animals, of course, all animals need protection, right? Some animals have built-in protection. Built-in, they have it as part of their bodies. Built-in protection. Built-in. Built-in protection. This shell is protecting the turtle. Tuck, 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 right? It's very hard, and the turtle will not be harmed because the shell protects the turtle. Protect, of course, means to cover and to make something safe. So if you look at this turtle, kind of an interesting character, he's very safe 
inside of his shell. He is protected. Okay, let's move on. Extinct. When, if an animal is extinct, it is no longer in existence. But think about that. If all the animals of the same type are gone, they all die, then they are extinct. What animals can you think of that have gone extinct? Some very famous animals. If you think of dinosaurs, D-I-N-O-S-A-U-R, S, dinosaurs. Dinosaurs, this is a dinosaur. There are no more dinosaurs in the world. They are all extinct. They are no longer in existence. They've all died. So we can say dinosaurs are extinct. Okay? American Textbook Reading Grade 1 Science Book 2 Lesson 1 What Animals Need to Grow Shelter A shelter is a place where an animal can be safe. Nest A nest is a place where birds live. Oxygen Oxygen is a gas that is necessary for people and animals to live. Oxygen has no color. Breathe. Breathe means to take in oxygen. Hatch. Hatch means to come out of an egg. Store. Store means to keep something for future use. Protect. Protect means to cover and make something safe. Extinct. If an animal is extinct, it is no longer in existence.